Hey guys, I need you to tell me what I'm doing wrong. Hello and welcome to the channel. I am Chris, this is Dirty Truck Row 8. And today we're doing something a little bit different. We're playing with the new TIG welder. It is an AHP 201 XD thing, something, something. Alpha TIG 201, oh, we're TIG welding. Now this is only the second time I've played with this machine. So I'm still extremely green. I am not a TIG welder by any means. <coughs> so what I need from you guys is to tell me what I'm doing wrong here. Now today we're going to be playing with a little bit of metal. I've picked up some scrap stuff from one of the local steel places here in town. And we're going to be playing with a little bit of overlap without doing filler rod. So let's get started and then leave some comments below about what I'm doing wrong. Here we go. Start out with a couple tacks to hold everything together. I do have four pieces that we're going to be playing with today. So we'll have a few different beads to run. Hopefully I'm not doing too bad, but let me know. got our pieces tacked together here. Hopefully the camera behind the uh, welding mask there is showing a reasonably decent angle. I'm not quite sure if it is or not. It's hard to see through that thing without having this going and being on both sides is impossible. I'm gonna run a bead. I got a few holes in that one. They're not terrible. Number one. Push it out of the way. Start on number two.
That one's got a few holes in it too. Number two. So what do you guys think of this one? Let's flip them over and weld the other side. Unfortunately, I haven't dipped my tungsten yet. That's number three. Number three. Let's go for number four. And that's the fourth one. Now I'm not using any filler rod on these. I'm trying to get used to a pattern, laying down a reasonable bead and carrying that flow with me. I don't think they look terrible, considering this is the second time I've used this machine and like the third time I've ever touched a TIG welder. But like I said, let me know what you guys think below. I'm curious all sorts of the tips and advice that you can give me Hopefully you guys come up with some stuff that's going to make TIG welding a whole lot easier on me. And be sure and check out those comments too if you're like me and you're just a TIG welding beginner. Hopefully some of those comments below might help you too. But that's it for today guys. Not a super long video. I just wanted to play with my new toy. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Thanks for hanging out. And you're done too.